joined by the champion trying to drive a Mark Purden. First of all, Smold, he's got a difficult draw in the second heat. How's he going, Mark? Uh, he's settled in well, Gareth, and uh, yeah, it's going to be awkward, but uh, he goes into it well. He had a, a big campaign in, during that New Zealand Cup time. Um, has he come through that well? Yes, he has, yeah. He just started on the Tuesday, so he didn't. He was flying on here on the Friday, so uh, just that one hard run, but uh, he seems to have bounced back good from it. What do you do from the draw? Just got to play it by ear and just see who's coming out and how much speed is on early. And um, you know he's gonna he's gonna have to make a move at some stage if he's um, if he's not handy early in the race. He's good enough in your eyes that you see him do a little bit of work and show his class again that we've seen so many times over here. Yeah, you know he is tough and that's his forte. And and uh, if he's got to do the work, he's got to do it. Everyone's really looking forward to seeing Mr. Mahita go around in that four-year-old Group 1. How is he? Because he's such an exciting pacer. He is exciting, Gareth, and, and probably got the worst draw he could have draw, drawn. So it's, it's going to be a hard race for him. But uh, I'm very pleased with the way he's worked and settled in here. Do you try and take luck out of the equation and get off that fence early? Oh, for sure, yeah. I, I, it looks like a race where if you, if you stayed on the, the one horse's back, you're probably going to end up three back at best and, and possibly further back. So... The first opportunity, if it's there, I'm going to grab it. How good is he? Well, uh, he's probably excited us over the last sort of six or eight weeks and, and uh, really stepped up. He's learned what it's all about. He's got a lot of speed and uh, he appears to have the all-round game.